Hi, I'm Cal Spellman, and these are my confessions. Confessions. What is the last time you pretended not to have received an email or text when really you just ignored it? I can't believe you've asked me that question. I should probably give you a heads up. I am the worst person with my phone. It takes me anything from three days to three weeks to get back to people on things. You know, actually haven't returned my texts recently. Ah, well, that, I was hoping we could maybe speak after about that. Have you ever broken something and blamed it on somebody else? Yes. What was it? Well, whatever it is, I usually blame my younger brother. <laughs> Stick it on our kid. Have you ever broken wind and blamed it on someone else? I'm known for that sort of stuff. Do you want to know, do you want to know the best, best place to do it? And honestly, this is, this is a tip from Cal. If you stood in a lift, yeah? Mm. Quite busy, minding your own business with your mates, and you go, have you... Oh, you haven't, right? And you know what that does? Because if they turn around and go, no, it wasn't me, it's that, definitely was, and they go, oh, yeah, yeah, of course it was me. So either way, you've got them. That's the way to do it's it. It's cunning. Have you, have you just been there? Don't try it on me. <laughs> What is the silliest mistake you've ever made professionally? I did a play of um, Oliver Twist, and I was playing Oliver. Mr. and Mrs. Bumble, basically, it was kind of like a, you know, stage magic, so I came out from under a trap door on the stage. Mr. and Mrs. Bumble kind of stood like that, and I'm walking behind them, and then they step apart, and, oh, you've just appeared, where did you come from? <clears throat> so I've come out under the stage, looked down, and I had on my feet, I had these big Scooby-Doo slippers. You know, like the oversized ones, but like tongue sticking out. You know, like you can get from joke shops, like big, big slippers. So I was, I was walking while the, while the scene's going, I quickly like took them off and I had hold of these Scooby-Doo slippers. I was like shaking, I was crying. I thought, I can't be stood here with these Scooby-Doo slippers as Oliver Twist. So I've just had to launch them, one either side. The audience started cracking up because they've just seen two slippers go, boom, either side. They've stepped apart and I've just stood there like a blubbering mess, like <laughs> tears streaming, had the shakes and all sorts. I thought, this is my career over. Have you ever taken a phone call while in the toilet? Yes. Yeah, of course. Good place to chat on the toilet, actually. Good thinking time. Number ones and twos? Number ones and twos. On the ones and twos. Have you lied during this interview? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have. Actually, have I? No, no, I haven't. Are you lying now? Maybe.